Hey, come on, everyone. My name is Justin. Um, so this is a bit more informal kind of video. This is uh, my vlog, my bi-monthly vlog, and I decided to start it off um, on January. Uh, currently, it's January 16th. Sorry, 16th here in the Philippines. Um, yeah. So a bit about me. Uh, I'm Justin Andre Avendano. I'm currently 19. Uh, I'm a freshman in Stevens Institute of Technology in Hoboken, New Jersey. Um, I used to go to um, Seton Hall uh, University, just to, like down from Hoboken. Uh, I'm from the Philippines. Most of the time, you'll see me um, active at night. Um, if you're talking about like Asia time, but in the US, I'll be awake in the morning afternoonish yeah um so this vlog was so that i could um show people what i'm doing uh more in the scientific side yeah so right now i'm actually filming uh for another video which is about um one of my more recent addictions in a game called valorant yeah i play with my friends and um, we play a lot i'm not good I'm completely trash, but it's fun. You know, we're having fun. Uh, but yeah, stay tuned for that. It's a pretty cool video. Um, what else? Science. Yeah. So currently, I am in a research group um, headed by one of the professors in Stevens, uh, and they're discussing um, quantum optics. Really cool stuff. Really weird. I I don't get a lot of it. So here, I'm a freshman. I don't really know much about quantum optics, but I am. I can say I know a bit about optics, and even less about quantum mechanics. I just know, like the bare minimum. And when I came into the um, research group, I didn't know jack shit. <laughs> I didn't know anything, but I was really curious because I really love learning new things, even though I don't really get it, and I wanted to see. Um, maybe this might be a path I might take, you know, because, um, well, I went into physics mostly because I want to become an astronaut or, um, go into astrophysics. So that was my, um, planned route, but I wanted to see him. Maybe I wanted to go into quantum mechanics because I really got into quantum computing over, um, the summer. Um, yeah, maybe I can make a video about that. Let's see. Um, let's see how that goes. So yeah, tell me about if you really want to see about quantum computing which is it's really cool because it's like have your computer do everything at the snap at the same time if that makes sense um yeah uh quantum optics so i i'll try to refrain from using their names just to make sure you know for privacy issues but um so this professor allowed me to come into the um, research group and it's mostly graduate students presenting um, the research to the professor and seeing if they need anything new or like they need to fix something and holy shit that's a lot of weird math but it's really cool so even though the math is like higher calculus and like linear algebra which i still don't get um it's very intuitive it's very intuitive in, uh, in the sense that if they you can just ask them like what does this mean and then after you get what the equation means it becomes very intuitive why those they use a specific kind of notation and um as you get to know the equation more it explains a lot of what they're talking about even better than the paragraph and when they're talking if that makes sense like that one equation that they show usually shows a lot more than what their paragraph is saying Let's say, for example, like, I don't know, the bell error curve thing about like degrees of freedom. And like, basically it shows um, how much, how far an electron can move in a certain way, I think. I'm not sure, but um, it's pretty cool. Not my thing. I don't really like quantum optics, but it's pretty cool. I might not continue it because um, it's gonna conflict with my schedule and I'm not really interested in, in, in it anymore. It's just for like gimmick thing to see how it goes. 
but um yeah that's pretty much what i wanted to see um yeah i just wanted to see how all these different sub genres of quantum mechanics have worked out in stevens it's pretty cool though um so the reason why i switched out to stevens from seton hall is because i found that um stevens had more opportunities in physics compared to seton hall um that was my observation i guess like there are more different labs in stevens in stevens we have like an astrophysics department we have a quantum mechanics and then the quantum mechanics is sub uh sub categorized into optics computing and we have a freaking quantum computing lab which is freaking amazing um but then in Seton hall we had a plasma laser lab and an observatory pretty much all i saw for the most part but they're still pretty cool. I mean, Seton Hall has um, pretty cool stuff in physics and they have an amazing community. I'm still friends with a lot of people there. And, you know, uh, the friends I have at Seton Hall, they'll never be replaced. Uh, so yeah, shout out to my friends from Seton Hall who are watching this. Um, no matter what, even if I moved to Stevens, you guys are still one of my favorite friends. Um, yeah. Um, Stevens, what else? So, I might um like move out of the research group um by february by february i'll leave that research group say thank you that's pretty much what i'm going to be doing um yeah that's pretty much it it's like a small update introduction video to see who i am who's making the videos um and to see like cool things that you might like to hear more about so if you want to hear more about like quantum computing or other shenanigans i've been trying to do and see if you might like it i can make another video about these talk uh talk to you privately like dm me email me i don't know linkedin facebook instagram whatever um yeah that's pretty much it so thanks for watching this first vlog um watch out for my next video which is getting pretty cool hopefully it does well um this is probably the most mathematical intensive video i've done in a while so that's gonna be cool uh and yeah that's pretty much it all right guys um so yeah thanks for watching um hope i see you in the next video and if you like to see anything else leave it down in the comments and yeah see you next time guys